Right everyone, I've done a massive walk, more than I needed to. I could have cut across between those two points which I missed. I haven't got the energy now to go back and do those so I'll have to, I'll have to come back another time to do those. But I've been on a massive hike actually, it was much bigger than I thought. But that's the thing with Reque. We've never been to a place in the maps. Um, I just followed the map. I was following the map, but um, it was um, the terrain and the weather's changed now. It's very um, blowy. that I was, went down that way earlier. I did see those stones when I was there. Somehow I thought I would come back that way and what it was, there wasn't a path. It took me right round and then it was going to be quite complicated going over that other side back to the beacon. So I've, I've um, used a small county road it's called now. The weather is changing as well. Um, there is a possibility there might be a path, but it's going to be the path I came on earlier. The path in a minute is going to be the one I came down from the beacon on, but I wanted to do an alternative path up to the beacon. Anyway, I've stopped on a couple of benches, I've taken loads of photos of the scenery, but it's been an uphill. It's, I've been coming uphill for, well, it's, it's not very far, I don't speak as far, but it's a big, steep climb. This is the biggest climb I've done today. And, uh, basically, that's the beacon's over there, but I'm not going to go back to it now. I have done it, that was the most important thing. Um, I have done the beacon, and I nearly got as far as Wooden Courtney, or Courtney Wooden, whatever you want to call it, church, but I never quite made it. I'm a bit disappointed that I missed those two barrows over there. Um, Disappointed I I missed those because I would like to have loved to have come back. I would have loved to have gone back another way. Um, I would have loved to have gone back another way back to the beacon. That would have been nice, but I don't fancy walking back up that hill. I've already done enough hills now. It's getting late as well. It's a two hour journey home. Um, we're coming to a spot I, got, I came to quite a while ago now. Quite a while ago, I came to a spot here. And uh, I'm not gonna go back up that way. The weather is changing. The most important thing is I did the beacon. Here we are. I just, I'm just a bit upset. I missed that over there, to be quite honest. That would have finished the day off nicely if I could have done that, you know. So here we are. Three quarters of a mile up there. But I'm not going to do it. I'm going to be lazy and walk back the roadway. 
I've already done masses of walking. If the weather hadn't started to change, I probably would have got out and walked over to there. But uh, energy levels are getting a bit low now. I've had my jelly. And it's not really far now. It's very windy. It's going on for five o'clock. So I've been out for five hours walking. It's about my normal thing. And I've had a really good look about. Believe me, I have. And at that point there will be done, but I'll drive there. Drive and walk up there next time. I've got a few churches I want to do, which I'm going to drive to. I mean, the good thing today is I did get, I did capture the deer. So that was one good thing. I did capture the deer. Not right up close, unfortunately. There's, there's another way up to the beacon, but the thing is, they advise you not to, because it does causes erosion. And there's lots of spaces like this where you can park, by the way. park here and get a quicker way up to the beacon, see? Or maybe go over to the stones over there. No. I've got a nice bit of roast chicken at home, waiting. Um, a nice pudding. I've achieved most of the things I wanted to. Obviously, I was hoping to come back towards the beacon from another direction, but it didn't work out like that. It would have meant really doing quite a big diversion, and I needed at least two more hours to do it. It wasn't something I could rush, because it meant walking through a, quite a big wood and all that, and all new stuff. Another place in the park. <laughs> Quite remote though to leave your vehicle. That's another reason I didn't want to be too long. I don't want to get back and find old Burger's gone or she's been broken into or a tire slashed, anything. You'll get some nasty people. Most of the time you don't, of course. Right, over and out.